Welcome to the user interface tutorial for Keyshot 4. In order to understand the UI workflow in Keyshot, it is important to understand the directory structure and location of your Keyshot 4 resources folder. To identify or change the location, go to Edit, Preferences, Folders. Here you can specify location for all folders, or customize for each individual folder, say to a server location. These folders correspond directly to the InKeyShot library. This folder is the default location of stored assets such as materials, textures, environments, backplates, and animations. Keyshot will automatically refer to these folders for seen assets when opening a BIP file. In order to ensure all assets are saved with your file, if planning to share or open on another machine, save as a package. Working with Keyshot, you can dramatically improve workflow efficiency by familiarizing yourself with the hotkey list, which can be toggled by pressing K. This list identifies several features relating to UI, such as full screen mode, presentation mode, and the hotkeys for your toolbar, library, project, and animation windows. These windows can be docked to help organize your workspace by click, drag, and release over locations identified by a blue box or by double clicking on the window header. Your toolbar can also be docked or floated and when right clicking you're given the option to hide text or change the size of your toolbar icons. When working with complex scenes, press Alt-P to enter performance mode. This disables features such as shadows and ray bounces and can make it easier to apply materials and see what's going on in your real-time view. Another useful resource to be aware of is the Keyshot 4 manual, which can be accessed under the Help menu. Refer to this for a more detailed explanation of topics covered in this and other tutorials.